The Justice Department now delving deeper into President Biden's handling of classified records. Attorney General Merrick Garland appointing a special counsel to oversee the investigation. Former Maryland U.S. Attorney and Trump appointee Robert Hur on the case. This appointment underscores for the public the department's commitment to both independence and accountability. The investigation spanning months. November 2nd, Biden's attorneys discovered classified documents at the Penn Biden think tank in Washington. The lawyers then informing National Archives, which reached out to the Department of Justice. Sources tell ABC News at least 10 documents, some with top secret details on several foreign countries, were found. Garland assigned Chicago U.S. Attorney John Lausch, also a Trump appointee, to launch a preliminary review. Then, December 20th, Additional documents bearing classification markings were identified in the garage of the president's private residence in Wilmington, Delaware. President Biden responding. Classified material next to your Corvette. What were you thinking? Let me, uh, the, I'm going to get a chance to speak on all this, God willing, soon. But as I said earlier this week, people, and by the way, my Corvette's in a locked garage. Then Wednesday, Biden's personal lawyer alerted DOJ about one more classified document found in Biden's Wilmington home. Former President Donald Trump reacting in a radio interview overnight. It's a disgraceful situation. The White House is quick to note that unlike Trump, who took more than 300 classified documents to Mar-a-Lago and fought efforts to return them, Biden and his team contacted the National Archives, voluntarily turned over the materials, and are fully cooperating with the investigation. And the White House also saying in Biden's case, the classified materials were inadvertently misplaced and that the president acted promptly upon discovery of the mistake. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.